Hello, good to have you with us here on Focus on Africa from BBC World News. Is Somalia on the cusp of a new era of prosperity and opportunity? The United Nations Secretary General says that after decades of conflict and instability, the conditions are now in place for it to become a success story. Now, he was speaking at an international gathering here in London, and Somalia's president was also there, saying that his country has a golden opportunity to put its troubled past behind it. The BBC's Mary Harper has this report. The great and the good assembled for the third London conference, the latest in a long string of high-level gatherings that have tried to sort Somalia out since it collapsed into chaos 30 years ago. Delegates promised that this conference would be different, more than a talking shop, that Somalia would never again return to its terrible past. Well, I see international conferences as a process, not a product where you deliver something right away. You agree on a set of procedures and set of uh, uh, steps and policies uh, and agreements to be implemented over a period of time. The conference pledged to help Somalia take responsibility for its own security, more resources and more joined up training for the army and police. Now, Somalia has outsourced its security to more than 20,000 African Union troops, U.S. drones, foreign advisors and private security companies. This conference has made ambitious commitments. A new security plan, one person, one vote elections in 2021 and a new deal for the economy. But delivery will be difficult, if not impossible. The worst drought in living memory didn't feature as a headline topic at the meeting. But delegates called for more international help and said they were fully mobilised to avert widespread famine. Mary Harper, BBC News. Well, Mary, 